Hey everyone, this is Adam and today I'm going to be showing you a quick tutorial on how to automatically arrange and tidy up your slides in Figma using the Pitch Deck plugin. So to get started, all you need to do is go to your Figma file, click on the little resources icon up the top here, and then if you just search for Pitch Deck, so that's P-I-T-C-H, D-E-C-K and under the plugins tab if you click on the pitch deck item you can run the plugin by clicking on this run button here or I'd recommend clicking on this little save icon here and that'll save it to your plugins list for easy access later. So I've already done that so I'm going to go to my canvas I'm just going to right click anywhere and go down to plugins go down to saved plugins and then click on pitch deck and that's just going to run the plugin we saved a second ago. So if you're new to the plugin the way that it works is it basically allows you to add a bunch of uh, frames or components as slides onto your Figma page and then load those up into the plugin and add animations and links and then export them to various formats. So I'm not going to be going into detail about that today. Today I'm just going to be showing you how to use some of the new uh, tidy features and sorting features to help organize your slides uh, in the Figma file. So the first thing you'll notice is that uh, if we move around our slides uh, on the page uh, it's obviously going to get pretty messy pretty quickly. Um, having said that, we can use the order that's on the page to sort uh, the slides in the plugin. So for example, if you wanted to sort uh, these slides visually, so if we wanted to sort them into columns, we can do that in the plugin. So we can sort them uh, visually. So for example, if I go from right to left, you can see now it's basically taking the last slide uh, in the columns and making that the first slide. So the order in the plugin is different to the order in the Figma file. So that's just the first thing to keep in mind. Uh, the second thing is that we can also drag and drop these manually. So if you wanted to change the order of these in the presentation plugin, you can do that by dragging and dropping. Uh, you can also remove slides from the presentation just by unchecking them. So these won't get exported in the uh, exported formats like PDF or PowerPoint or the web presentation. So I'm just quickly running you through those basics to show you how this is now going to work with the sorting feature. So now if I go ahead and click on this little page icon up here in the top left of the plugin and open up this panel, you can see that I've got an option for automatically uh, sorting and tidying our Figma slides. So what we can do is we can basically say how many slides we want per row. So in this case, I'm just going to say 12. And we've also got an option to add a fade effect for any unchecked slides. So I'll show you what that looks like in a second. First, I'm just going to tidy these up by clicking on the reorder and tidy Figma slides button. So I'm just clicking on that now. And you can see it instantly tidies up the uh, slides based on the order that we already had set up in our presentation over here. So you can see slide one and slide two uh, have been added uh, in that order, whereas uh, the other slides at the bottom have been added down here. So you can see the last slides have been uh, rearranged there. The same thing would be true if we rearrange these again. So for example, uh, if we swap these around and made this slide uh, go down here, then jump back into our page icon, open up that panel, and again, click on the reorder and tidy, that's gonna automatically rearrange those slides once again. So basically the order in the plugin is the source of truth for this new feature. So whatever you set the plugin order to uh, will automatically be tidied up in here. So you can change this to be eight slides per row or make it a really long one at 20 slides per row. And as I mentioned a second ago, you've also got this toggle over here to add a fade effect for any unchecked slides. So I'll show you what that looks like if you toggle that on and then re-click on this button here. That's automatically gonna fade uh, any of the unchecked layers in your presentation plugin to an opacity of 33%. So that kind of just visually knocks them back. So at a glance, you can get a sense of which slides are actually active and which slides uh, aren't active. And of course, if you re-enable those uh, in the plugin, so if we just check a couple more back on and then open up the panel again, reorder them again with the toggle uh, enabled, that will automatically re-enable the opacity on those. Uh, if you wanna get rid of that effect entirely, just turn off the toggle and again, click on the reorder and tidy button and that will just make sure the opacity gets reset uh, back to 100%. So yeah, that's basically a quick overview of how you can use this new feature to really quickly automatically tidy up your slides. If you're moving things around in the plugin over here and rearranging slides and you don't wanna have to uh, manually kind of reorder them, you know, on the page, which can get a bit annoying. 
Uh, you can now just do that in one click. So again, you just go to the pages icon, click on the little reorder button, and that will automatically tidy up your slides. So I hope that's helpful. If you've been wondering how to quickly uh, tidy up your slides into a grid and reorder them based on your pitch deck uh, slide order over here, uh, this is a brand new feature that will help you do that uh, really quickly and hopefully save a lot of manual time uh, dragging and dropping slides around on your page. So thank you as always for watching and we'll be back with more Figma tutorials like this one very soon.